the fact that we could engineer something that is that functional, but yet that beautiful, it, it's, it's hard to put into words what that means, but after almost 26 years, I still have a sense of wonder, have a sense of a, a, a marvel. The sensitivity of the GBT is, is phenomenal. The equivalent energy of a single snowflake hitting the ground is much greater than the energy that the GBT is trying to receive. So that kind of gives you an idea of how completely obtrusive man-made interference is to what we're trying to do here. Keeping the transmissions of today's world out of this area is an extreme challenge. Refrigerators, printers, washers, dryers, light bulbs, everyone puts Wi-Fi in their devices. So the whole path of uh, technology has been to make everything interconnected. Losing the quiet zone would simply be devastating to our science. What we would lose is the capability to detect the birth and the death of a star or the existence of life outside of our own solar system. Uh, do I think that life exists out there? Absolutely. So if we were to lose the quiet zones, we would never get those quiet zones back. Available now on Video On Demand.